Okay, we've got a typical exam style question here for AQA computing uh, for floating point. And we're just going to work our way through this. So let's read it first. So the binary pattern, etc., can be interpreted in a number of different ways. Part A, state its value in deanery if it represents an unsigned. Okay, so it's an unsigned value. Um, to the fixed point four bits after the binary point. So what we've got is one zero 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 one one zero zero binary point zero one zero zero. So it's unsigned. So we've got a one two one two four. We've got an eight no sixteen thirty two sixty fours. We've got a 128 there. Add those together, and we've got 140. We've also got, after the binary point, a quarter. So 140.25. Okay, and the next one it says uh, state the value if it's a twos complement floating point number with an 8 bit. Mantissa and a four bit exponent. So once again we have our number and we're assuming it's a normalized floating point value. That means that here is our exponent and this part is our mantissa. And <coughs> The exponent is a positive value because we've got a, a leading, no significant bit as a zero. It's one, two, and a four, so it's a plus four for the exponent. That means that our binary point is going to float one, two, three, four places to the right. Uh, and if we now calculate this as a value, we've got a one. So if we look at here, we've got a one. We've got no twos, fours, eights, and we've got a 16. But no, because it's a one, and we're using twos complement here, that means it's negative 16 plus our one. And then after the binary point, we had a one, which gives us a value of 0 0.5. So we can add 0 0.5 to this. And that ends up then being 16 plus 1 minus 15 plus another half gives us an answer of minus 14.5. I hope that helps seeing how you might tackle a typical exam style question like this. Hopefully you'll be a bit neater than I am.